Welcome back, folks. We are back up online with a new studio in upstate New York, and I'm going to be working on a new project over the next couple of days, which is a gift for my girlfriend for Christmas. And that will involve this here object. Okay, so we're gonna take this and we're gonna actually fill it in with leather, paint the leather gold and turn it into an object of desire. So what I've done so far is I've taken this big scrap of leather here and I've kind of, after doing a couple of failed attempts at a, at a sort of template, I tried to kind of roll it and outline it so I could just try to make it in one piece and fit, but that did not work. This was the failed attempt. So what I decided to do was just go a tiny little bit at a time, right? And make little pieces and then put the little pieces together to form the final, um, the final product here. So what you have to do is adapt and overcome. Okay, so I did a little test piece here, basically um, with a gold acrylic. The gold really kind of shimmers and we're gonna go with this look. All right, here we go with the first piece. We're gonna put it right in with this rubber cement and uh, see how that goes. So it looks like we have a mild success here. You can see the gold piece in there. Fit it in. I'm gonna have to fill in just a little bit of extra detail. All right, so I've gotten a little bit further. Let's see where this thing's at. Got another piece in there but it's getting a little more complicated. So what I tried to do was lay a piece of paper over the next part and outline it. All right, guys, we're getting super close now. So I've added two more pieces to this. Get a little closer up look. It looks terrible right now, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add that nice last piece. I'm gonna fill these in with little pieces of leather and then I'm actually gonna repaint it. So stay tuned. We've made some serious progress here and it's almost done. Check it out. Look at that. I got that nice curve in there. How does that look? And I'm just trying to keep that curve by gluing this, this top part here with rubber cement. All right, everybody, it's an exciting time because I've completed the entire shape, okay? So we have the shape here. Now I'm just gonna shave off some of this leather to give it a smooth surface, and then I'm gonna repaint it. I'm using this box cutter to just shave off little bits of this leather to make it smooth here. Last thing left to do is to paint this thing gold. On a scale of one to 10, this project has been ridiculous. Check me painting a little bit here. It's starting to look real nice. Let's see here. All right, guys, this is looking crazy. This is so, this is coming out so nice. I'm edging it with black to give it some drama. And we are all done. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs>